Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about something that I've been asked most frequent in my comments is how to delete a route on auto drive. First thing we're going to do is when you open up the editing menu. As you can see, I've changed it to final. This is the existing route that we've got from this previous tutorial series so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create another room I'm just going to do a simple circle this could be as long or as short as you need it to be we we'll go from short to a cell point from one side of map to other as long as you want so what I'm going to do is I'm quick save I'm just going to call this editing save that now if you look we've got both routes here saved I go into editing one quick load you'll see it loads them both up I go into final one quick load it just loads up the final one so that now enables us if we want to if we make a mistake on his editing route I can click on it quick delete quick yes load up the final and it's gone so that's an that's a way to do eat groups that you're currently in editing i've found that problem starts when you have multiple rules saved under different names so what i'll do is i'll do it again i'll just do another circle stop that i'll save that as editing go back out and then what I'll do is I'll do another circle that side of it and what I'll do is I'll call this editing to save that as you can see now we've got final editing which is the first circle we did and editing two which is the second circle so now if I wanted to delete the first circle I can go on to editing and I can delete it quick yes go back but then you can still see it's there if I go on to final load both circles have gone what I've found is when you save a file or you save a root like this editing tool if I load that up you can see both circles are there what I've found is when you save it whatever waypoints you've got plotted on your map when you save that root it'll save everything under that file so I can go on to final and load that and it'll just load that root because that's all that were there when I saved that root but if I go on to editing 2 and load that as you can see it's got this final root it's got editing 1 and it's got editing 2 because they were both in place when I created the second one so I think for me personally what I'll do is I'll have a final one which is everything that works fine with no problems whatsoever if I delete editing 2 just hold up final So that's my final route. I'll have that as my master copy for all my routes. So then when I want to create a new way, wait set of waypoints to the shop, I'll just drive wherever I'm going to. And I'll stop. 
what I'll do is I'll save it as editing or testing or something along them lines save it I'll then test that route make sure everything works make sure it works how I want it to work and if it does what I'll do then is I'll just overwrite the final one and save it under final so then I've got one for editing which is the current route I'm adding and then one for final which is everything that's working how it should do with no problems at all so then if I do need to delete a route and start again that I'm currently adding into auto drive I can just click on it quick delete quick yes go on to final quick load and then that route's gone again but I've still got my existing routes that I want already that work okay you can't have multiple files saved in your auto drive folder and then be able to delete each one as a different waypoint because all it will do is it will save all the files that are already added into it so when you delete one it will still be existing on another file so that's the way I do it if anybody finds a more simple way or another way to do it then let me know in comments below and I'll look at it and make another video but up to now that's the only way I can see a deleting full route we are actually using this red line to manually delete each waypoint if you like this video or any other videos in my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring notification bell also check out featured channels on my page there's some great youtubers on there check out their content subscribe to them as well thanks for watching